Well, I wanted to bring to everybody's attention uh, something that doesn't get much attention. And you've heard the term, follow the money. So I looked up where did follow the money. I thought it was from a Tom Cruise movie, but it wasn't. It was from Watergate. And follow the money is what they did in Watergate. And, and we saw what happened. So my young staffer, who's very bright, and I see him over there, Adam Pack, followed the money. And the money is from the so-called Inflation Reduction Act. So in the name of green and environmental justice, there's over $40 billion that are going to be granted out through the EPA. So with this great research that was done, what was discovered that in December, the EPA granted $50 million to an organization called Climate Justice Alliance. So we went to the website of, of Climate Justice Alliance. This is what we found on the website, that our taxpayer dollars are going to organizations such as this. This, at the bottom, is a picture of the bulldozer that went through the fence when Hamas attacked Israel in, on October the 7th. They have a rendering on their website. It says, Decolonize Palestine, and it has a picture of that same bulldozer going through that fence. If you dig deeper, they want to defund the police, defund the military, either them or their affiliates. Want to, want to have very radical, drastic uh, initiatives that I think are anti-American. And they're certainly anti-Israel and anti-Semitic. So the Biden administration doesn't seem to care. $50 million in December, who knows how much more in the future and other like groups, because there are other associated groups with this group. There's no inspector general for EPA to follow the money because they don't care, because all they care about is the mission, the climate mission, no matter what the radical ideas that are associated with the groups. So then you could ask yourself, is this group really going to be funding climate, you know, cleaning up the water and cleaning up the soil and cleaning up the air? Or are they going to be funding things like the protests they had in Hart just several weeks ago where several of them were arrested? So follow the money. We're going to be doing that in the Environment and Public Works Committee. That's where the derivation of this was. And I, th I find it rather startling to me that the EPA is not doing, and the administration, are not doing any better research as to where our American taxpayer dollars are going.